Welcome to the Smarter Money Life, hosted by Andy Mattingly, featured guest on Indy Now TV's Smart Money Minute, frequent financial expert for local news, and Smarter Money Life contributor at Forum Credit Union. Helping members live their financial dreams is at the core of what we do. Understanding how your decisions and habits impact your life is key to reaching those dreams. It's great to be back with you. I'm Andy Mattingly, and today we're going to talk about essential money habits to improve your financial health. So you've probably thought about this in improving your physical health. There's a, several essential things you need to do, you know, exercise, eat healthy, things like that. Well, in your financial health, there are a few essential moves you need to make. So I'm going to kind of talk about the top five, but there are several others. So let's just dive right in here. Very first thing, essential habit, spend less than you earn. And I know that may seem elementary, but a lot of people spend as much as they earn or sometimes even more using credit cards or other debt. You really need to spend less than you earn so you have money to put to savings and things like that. You are going to have some debt, but if you spend less than you earn, that's a good way to start getting ahead. And if you spend less than you earn, then you can do the next essential habit, which is build an emergency fund. And, and there's kind of two types. There's one for those every once in a while emergencies come up. You need some type of car repair or you have a medical expense. Things like that are kind of one-offs. And then there's the loss of income or reduction of income where you need to cover, you know, two or three months of expenses while you build back your income. If you have a medical emergency, a great emergency fund is a health savings account if that's offered to you because of the insurance plan you're in. Otherwise, start putting money in a high-rate savings account so that you can build an emergency fund when you need it. Another important concept or essential habit for your financial health is to know where your money is going. A lot of people just spend using their credit card, their debit card, whatever, and they have no idea how much money they're spending on anything. You, you may know what some of your bills are, but you really don't put it all together. So, you know, take a look back at 90 days and see where all of your money has went. You might be really surprised. And if you are spending everything that you earn or more than you earn, this will be something that will help you decide where you need to cut back, where you can realistically cut back, that is, so that you can start spending less that you earn, and then you can build your emergency fund. Now, another important key is building and maintaining your credit. No matter what stage of life you're in, you want to keep your credit score as high as possible. So, if you don't have a lot of credit, do some things to build your credit, which can be, you know, taking out a credit card but not putting a big balance on it. You know, getting an installment loan like a car loan. Things like that will help you build your credit. Maintain your credit by always paying on time, making sure you don't utilize all of your credit limits at one time. Those are the types of things that'll be very important. And then kind of the last one is, you know, use smart shopping habits. And, and the caveat here is use smart shopping habits all year long. You know, sometimes we're pretty good at just the basic shopping habits, but when the holidays come around or vacation comes around or birthdays come around, we may throw all of our shopping habits out the door and spend more money than we need to. Now, these five things aren't going to solve all of your problems in your life, but if you start doing these, they're going to make your financial health a little bit better. And then as you build the other essential habits, you're going to really be surprised at how much your financial life can improve. That's all we have for you today. Thank you for watching. To learn more, visit the Smarter Money Life page at forumcu.com, subscribe to the Forum Credit Union YouTube channel, and look for the Smarter Money Life podcast wherever you get your podcasts. Remember, Today you have the opportunity to build the tomorrow of your dreams. Until next time.